Here are the steps to successfully install your new Photodon screen protector. Begin the installation by cleaning the device screen and surrounding area. When practical, we recommend using a vacuum with a soft, clean dusting brush head to remove dust from the screen and installation area, and then wiping the screen with a microfiber cloth. Before installing the screen protector, find the test film piece that came with it. To apply the test film, carefully pull back the tabbed bottom liner about an inch to expose the adhesive side of the film. Starting at the edge, allow the adhesive part of the film you've exposed to touch the screen. Then, using your finger or a squeegee, apply pressure along the film as you remove the back liner the rest of the way. Use the squeegee to gently push out any remaining bubbles. Next, remove the front liner from the test film by pulling the orange sticker. You now have a small sample of what your screen protector will look and feel like on your screen. If you are not satisfied with the film, do not unpackage your screen protector and contact us at Photodon. If you are satisfied with the test film, you can remove and discard it. The next step will be verifying the size of the protector you received. Take the screen protector out of the bag and hold it up to your screen. There should be a half millimeter to one millimeter gap around the screen protector to allow for easier installation. After you have verified the size, clean both the device screen and screen protector with the cleaner and cloth provided to remove all dust. Use the protruding tab to carefully pull back the bottom liner one to two inches to expose the adhesive side of the film. Line up the edge of the protector along the edge of the screen. Be sure to leave the half millimeter to one millimeter gap along each edge to center the screen protector. Allow the edge of the exposed adhesive to begin adhering to the screen. If necessary, you can push down on the protector to begin this process. Once the entire edge of the protector is adhered, hold the rest of the screen protector up with one hand. Use the squeegee in your other hand to begin sealing the screen protector down along the screen, pulling off more of the bottom liner as needed. Take your time during this step. If you notice large bubbles, pull the screen protector back up far enough to remove the bubbles, then continue applying the protector. If you notice the alignment seems off, carefully remove the protector and start over. Small bubbles can be pushed to the closest edge with the squeegee. Small bubbles with a speck in the center usually indicate dust or hair. To remove the speck, locate the small white square of tacky tape included in your kit and expose the adhesive. It may help to use a marker to circle the speck on the top liner so that you don't lose track of where it is after pulling the film back. Pull back the screen protector past the spot where the dust is, then lightly press the exposed adhesive of the tacky tape to the dust particle. Dust trapped this way will usually stick to the adhesive side of the screen protector. Before continuing with the installation, gently wipe the screen clean with a cloth to remove any more dust. When you get close to the edge opposite where you started, remove the back liner down to one corner and continue applying as much of the screen protector as you can down to that corner. Before completely removing the back liner, look over the screen protector to ensure that there are no dust particles trapped under the protector and that you are satisfied with the alignment. When satisfied, pull the bottom liner the rest of the way off and seal down the corner of the screen protector. Use the squeegee or a finger to seal down the edges of the protector. Next, remove the front liner by pulling the orange sticker until the liner lifts off. You may need to again seal the edges of the film after removing the front liner. There you have it. You have successfully installed your Photodon screen protector.